The feast of the Immaculate Conception of the Blessed Virgin Mary is one of the most prominent Marian feasts in the Catholic Church. But it's also a tricky one when it comes to relationships with other churches and, in fact, other believers. The Immaculate Conception refers to the doctrine that Mary, from her very moment of her conception, was never stained by original sin. The word immaculate literally means pure, without blemish. Pius IX defined the doctrine in his proclamation of December the 8th, 1854. The most blessed Virgin Mary was, from the first moment of her conception, by a singular grace and privilege of Almighty God, and by virtue of the merits of Jesus Christ, Saviour of the human race, preserved immune from all stain of original sin. Different traditions have varying interpretations about Our Lady and her relationship to sin, but they all share the view that the woman chosen to be the mother of God was exceptionally pure and holy. Like all good theology, our understanding, guided by the Holy Spirit, took time, indeed centuries to form. This solemnity of Mary breaks with the penitential simplicity of the Advent season to give us a chance to celebrate the Mother of God, through whom the incarnation of the Word of God was made possible. As she is such an important figure in the Advent and Christmas season, the feast of her conception allows us to honour her as we prepare for the coming of Emmanuel. God is with us.